Hey everyone, welcome back to effect for you channel. Today, we are going to create, retro style opener, like this. So let's get started. First create a new comp, 1920 by 1080. This is our main comp. Now create a new solid layer. Select layer and search fill effect. And change fill color. Now create one more composition. This is our texture comp. Drag texture image into the timer line, select layer and search motion tile effect. Change output width and height 300. And check mirror edges. Now we need to animate this. So open position and rotation, go to first frame and add a keyframe. Then go to 3 frame forward and move the position, and change rotation 90 degree. Again go to 3 frame forward, and move position and also change the rotation. Similarly do this for few frames. After animate the position and rotation, select all keyframes, right click and select toggle hold keyframe. Now add loop out expression. Hold out and click on stopwatch icon, then go to property, and select loop out expression. Copy this expression and apply on rotation also. Perfect. Now go to main comp and drag texture comp into the timer line. Change layer mode multiply, and opacity 70%. Now select star shape tool, and create a shape like this. Press off rotation and apply time expression. Now press S for scale, go to 1 second forward, and add a keyframe on scale, then go to first frame, and change scale amount 0%, select both keyframe and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Also change layer mode, linear burn, and opacity around 20%. Perfect. Now select ellipse tool, and create a circle like this. Select star shape layer and change track mat alpha mat. Here you can see. Now select top shape layer, and search fast blur effect. And increase blur radius around 300. Now select star shape layer, and add twist effect. and change angle around 60. I think we need to increase opacity around 50%. Perfect. 
perfect. Now drag old film effect into the timeline, and change mode screen. Also change opacity 60%. Then drag micro dirt effect into the timeline, and change layer mode screen. Now select ellipse tool. Fill color none. And stroke color as you like. And create a circle like this. Change stroke around 50 pixels. Now we need to animate this. So at trim paths, open trim paths, go to first frame, change start 100% and add a keyframe, then go to 1 second forward, and change start 0%. Select both keyframe and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Perfect. Now move the circle bottom right corner of the comp. You can increase the scale and rotate the lay a little bit. Now duplicate the layer and decrease the layer a little bit. And change the color. Now duplicate layer one more time. And decrease the scale size. And change the color. Also offset the layer 2 to 3 frame forward. Perfect. Now create a null layer. And parent all shape layers with null layer. Select null layer press P for position, and add wiggle expression. Now duplicate null and shape layers. Move them together. And move the circle top left corner. Now create a new composition. 1920 by 1920. This is our placeholder 1 comp. Drag your image into the timeline. And resize according to the comp. Now go to main comp and drag placeholder 1 comp into the timeline. Now we need to animate this, so select rectangle tool, and create multiple mask like this. We need to create this mask until our placeholder one comp fully covered. You can adjust the gaping between masking. I am skipping this part so that you don't have to wait. Now we need to animate the masking, so select all mask and open. Go to first frame and add a keyframe. Then go to one second forward. Select mask 1, click on shape and change top pixels around 2100 pixels. Here you can see. Similarly select mask 2 and change top pixels 2100 pixels. Do the same with all mask. I am skipping this part so that you don't have to wait. I think we need to swap the keyframes, 
so select all first keyframes and move one and half second forward and second keyframes move to first frame. Select all keyframes and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now we can also offset the keyframes. Now duplicate placeholder layer, then select bottom layer and search fill effect. And change fill color white. Now select top placeholder layer, open mask, select all mask, and expand, and increase mask expansion around 50 pixels. And move the layer few frame forward. Cool. Adjust the placeholder left side of the comp. Also apply the posterize wiggle expression on both position. Perfect. Now create a new composition 1920 by 1080 pixels. This is our main text one. Select text tool and type your text. Now search drop shadow effect. Distance 30. Opacity 100% and change shadow color dark brown. Now animate the text, so open text layer, go to animate, and select position, scale, and rotation. Y position 70. Scale 0%. And rotation minus 50 degree. Now select animator 1, and add expression selector, here I have delay expression. So copy the expression, open expression selector, hold alt key and click on stopwatch icon, and paste it here. Perfect. Now duplicate the layer, and change your text. And move the layer few frame forward. Now go to main comp and drag main text 1 comp into the timeline. Resize the layer according to you. And adjust them. And move layer few frame forward. Cool. Now add another text here. So create new composition. I call this text 1. Select text tool and type your text. Then again select text tool, and create a paragraph box. And type your text. Now animate the first text, open text layer, go to animate, and add position and opacity. Change opacity 0%. Then select animator 1, and add expression selector. Open expression selector, copy delay expression. 
Hold Alt and click on stopwatch icon. And paste it here. Now animate our paragraph text, open text layer, and add position and opacity. Change position Y around 70. And opacity 0%. Now select animate to 1 and add expression selector. Here I have another delay expression. So copy the expression. Hold Alt key and click on stopwatch icon, and paste it here. Also change based on character to line. Move the layer few frame forward. Now go to main comp and drag text one comp into the timer line. Resize according to you. And move layer few frame forward. Now we need to add some other elements. So select rectangle tool, stroke none, and add fill color. And create a shape like this. Move the anchor point right center of the shape layer. Press S for scale. Go to first frame and add a keyframe, unlink scale amount, and change X scale amount 0%. Then go to 1 second forward, and change scale amount 100%. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Also move this layer below the circle layers. I call this line. Now duplicate the layer line shape layer. And change fill color. Move the layer below the first line layer. And move layer few frame forward. Perfect. Now select star shape tool. And create a star like this. Open poly star 1, then open poly star path, and increase in radius. Now press S for scale, go to 20 frames forward, and add a keyframe, then go to first frame and change scale amount 0%. Select both keyframe and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Also apply time expression on rotation. I call this flower. Move this layer below to lion's layer. And move both footage layers above the all layers. It's look good to me. Now duplicate the flower layer, and adjust other side of the comp. Fill color none. And stroke size around 8 pixels. You can resize the layer. Perfect. Our animation has done. Hit 0 for ender. Thanks for watching. I hope you like the video. So please like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel. For more tutorial, I'll see you in the next video.